I registered under the wrong GP. One thing about Mac, Mac, because somebody's gonna see crazy. It's small here, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> what? You know just what you do, you do to me. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're a returning subscriber, you're the real MVP. And if you're a first time subscriber, I love you so much for being here. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. So, um, first of all, no more introductory process. My name is Lydia Patterson for those who don't know my name. And um, I usually talk about my life and how I go about every little detail in the UK. So in my last video, if you had the chance to watch it, I spoke about getting your NI, which um, which I also shared my own experience on how I processed my NI N number in the UK. So today we will be um, just talking a little bit about how to get your how to uh, register under a GP in the UK. So before I go into this, firstly, when I started the process to register under a GP, I think I kind of like, I, re I registered under the wrong GP actually. I did register under the wrong GP and I was kind of like scared at the first time because I thought maybe I won't be able to, uh, I won't be able to get out of the GP or cancel my registration and move into a new one but you can actually so basically what i did when i first started i didn't i couldn't find any gp for some reason within my catchment area so what i did was i called up the gp which i felt was close enough to my um to my house and I spoke to them and I explained everything to them and they said it was fine and was okay. So I went ahead and I registered with them. However, they are not within my catchment area, but you can't, there's a way you can actually go about it if it's not within your catchment area. Some GPs actually take patients outside the catchment area while some do not. So if you're going to go ahead and register under a GP, one of the first things I'm going to advise anyone coming to the UK or in the UK trying to register for anything UK related, I would say your first go-to point should be the UK government websites. You will get every little, just the tiniest details on the UK government website, or you can also come to my YouTube channel for more details. <laughs> but yeah, so... I would post up the slide just like I did in the previous one on how to go about this process. So see you back in a bit. So you guys, first step to do is to go to your uh, computer and search how to... So if you see, I've already like searched this a thousand times before, but go there. And then you go to the first one how to register with the GP surgery NHS and then move back a bit so yeah you have you can see the heading and then you just scroll down and go to find the GP then at this point you put in your postcode that's where you stay so just a lot of um, GPs that will come up that are with, within your um, catchment area so you just go through anyone and then you can start from the top but let's see let's see this one so once you go to whichever um, GP you want to check out so you scroll down so yeah you have the address the phone number and then you have online health and prescription prescription services so you just go to visit gp surgery websites 
and then once you go there you have the phone number again the location messages and their twitter handle so there are a lot of information here to look at but since you are um registering for the first time you go down to general inquiries register as a new patient update your prescription just you go to general inquiries for this particular gp other ones might be different then you click and then you have registration so you have register as a new patient register as a care app so you register as a new patient and then once you go on to that part so some gps will ask you to check if it's within your catchment area where some wouldn't but for some gps if they are outside your catchment area you can still go ahead and still register with them while some you can't so you can go here and just check so you do the same thing again you put in your postcode then you search and then it will come up here and it will tell you tell you if it's within your catchment area or not and then if you know it's within your catchment area you can just continue to the new patient registration form and you'll be asked a few questions so personal questions which you can answer yourself and then you just go on to next then you fill in your medical history and all that then you submit it i think it takes like about a week or two for everything to be finalized to be about so yes guys so you can just go on to pick which one you or which gp you want here it has a reception opening days so there are a lot of information here to go to go on and you know check and all that so this is for this particular gp so you can also check another one there are lots of them a lot of them you can check you can also read the reviews as well when i tried to pick mine i went through the reviews to see you know how it's just to give it a rating on my own side so you guys it's as simple as that you can call up the gp before you register to get more information you can um do your own research on or you can also go through reviews on their websites on all the gp websites and basically just pick the one that you feel you'll be most comfortable with and um however that was the process i went through and it was very easy i think it they're going to send a message but i can, really can't remember how long it took for my gp to be approved but it didn't take so long it didn't take so much time it was very straightforward everything is just straightforward guys it's self-explanatory so yeah also i was supposed to mention this and uh, the beginning of this video but for some reason i just forgot about it so anyway if you've gotten here there's no need for you to go anywhere you can just stay to the end of the video because i think i'm going to be trying out a few or a couple of outfits i got from so i got a delivery that came in today and i just thought to share with you guys so this is going to be a gp slash you know outfit trial haul whatever whatever and then we're going to open the package together so do not go anywhere i got something from the tiktok shop i've been seeing it everywhere and i just decided to get something from tiktok this is my first order from tiktok and finally i got something from pretty little thing i couldn't help myself anymore i just had to get something from pretty little thing so what i'll do is i'll open the tiktok shop first and then we'll open the mac and then we'll open the pretty little thing so let's go so i've been i've been seeing this everywhere on tiktok and i was like okay let me just try it out and i decided to buy it was it was cheap per se the price had, the price had gone down I was always getting sold out for some reason. Anytime I want to get it, it's always getting sold out, sold out. So at some point I saw that they had restocked and I just got it ASAP. So this is it. Like Sharoma. But let's see, let's see. It's looking smaller than what I saw in the video though. Well, I do like the packaging. 
little package. Okay, so this is what I got. <laughs> For anyone who probably thought this before I brought this out, yes, I I got this. I got the rosemary oil. Rosemary oil. I got the rosemary oil. <laughs> So I just thought to give this a try and I do hope you guys stick around to see the process for me but I think it takes about three to six months for you to see the um, the results so let's hope for consistency <laughs> but yeah okay so on to the next one the MAC cosmetics for some reason, I don't know why this wasn't taped. I don't know why this wasn't taped because I don't want to be looking for anything. Hold on, let me bring out my list so that I can count them as I'm going on. Okay, so I have my list out here now. So let's go ahead and open this. Because somebody's gonna see crazy if anything here is missing. There's one thing about Mac. Mac. The devil is a liar. The devil is a big liar. Something with MAC and dark colors, which I like. It's very elegant, but yeah. So, so here we have the Studio Radiance. So my sister actually helped me buy Muzo because my sister worked with MAC here in the uk at some point and they also walked to charlotte tailsbury i got a few things also from charlotte tailsbury which i've already opened so there's no need to do that as well so let's see my list studio radiance moisturize moisturizer Most moisturizing yes so this is intact and then i got the um mac lip pencil i got the liquid last 24 hour waterproof eyeliner uh -uh. it's small here oh jesus christ <laughs> what? What? I... Okay. guys images can deceive you and then pro long wear concealer so i got the concealer um what else is this so i got the brow set so this is a brow gel. Ah, these things they look small in real life. But yeah, I got this. And um so my sister was the one who picked this. This is the blue. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Chromogra chromographic pencil. The chromographic pencil. Yeah, so this is the blue one. So my sister put this in for herself because at some point I didn't know what else to get again. And um, finally, we got the gel pencil eyeliner. I think this is the white one for like your under eye and all that. And finally, got foundation as well. And then I got pro sets and blow powder, so like setting powder. And that was basically everything I got from MAC Cosmetics. And what else again? The pretty little thing. Give me a minute while I move you guys back. So we we'll start with the first one. Which one will I start with first? Okay, so let's just bring all of them out one after the other. So I got this. I got this. Don't worry, I'll open it up later and then we'll see what it is. And then I got this. It's a jacket. And then finally, I got this. This one looks big old. So I got only four items, so we're going to try them one after the other. First of all, this is the back of this one here, yeah. which is okay, but let me show you the front. What is going on here? Why do I look like as if I got into a fight with, with somebody over their boyfriend in the market? I don't understand. Because, guy, this so I, I don't understand how I'm supposed to do this. Because wait when i on on the website yeah this was how it was let's be honest it, it had a deep v which was why i picked it this was how it was 
But then, it. Well, let's just hope that this is the only one that is that is doing like this. I'll try on the other ones that they show you guys, cause I don't understand. Okay, so this is the second one. So I I kind of like wanted something a bit big and comfortable. Um, but the only part that I'm surprised that this is a medium, I would have probably guessed this to be a large or maybe an extra large. But it's okay, but I don't know. They just maybe if I like dress up well, maybe if I want to go to the gym or something. But I don't know. I, I don't know. It's just it's giving more of housewear than you know gym wear self at this point i should have listened to my instincts but i mean it's it's okay the one they're just putting me is the previous one i actually had plans for it wear it out tomorrow and now i don't even know let me flip up and flip up but yeah so this is the second one i'll try out the remaining two and then we'll see what they look like at this point, I don't know again. For oh, this is the top one. Uh, it's a bit rumpled because it was in the bag. But yeah, this is. I just saw this leather jacket and I was like, why not? And maybe it's because I'm not dressed. Like maybe it's because I'm not like you know dressed to make the outfits really pop. Oh yeah, this is what this looks like. Mm. Uh. <laughs> so I think this is the only one. <laughs> this is the only one I can fully say I carry a go market. <laughs> and all it's not bad oh all right okay so yeah so i think i'll i think i'll probably send the rest back i don't know because i the money i spent for this and let's not let's not go, go into that oh but yeah i, I so love this oh my god <laughs> i'm so out of way i'm going to my give them Da daddy <laughs> okay so this is the last of it and and now i see why they actually saved the last no save the best for the last this is really nice this is really 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 nice <laughs> my, oh my god look at that now look at that <laughs> so that's all on the deliveries i got today and thank you guys for sticking to the end of this video uh, I really do appreciate it and I do hope that you got the chance to like, subscribe, comment and also share this video. So I do hope to see you in the next video and take care and continue to spread the love. So bye guys and see you soon. Oh, oh, oh.